What's up guys, welcome back to my channel where we talk about all things volleyball. This is interesting lighting today because the sun is going down at 4 o'clock in the afternoon, which is so much fun. Anyway guys, quick update. Actually, not much of an update. We haven't played any matches since I recorded the last video, but we are playing tomorrow, Friday, and you will be seeing this video after we played. But wish us luck anyway. And then we will be traveling to Siberia, Russia to play a Champions League game against Lokomotiv Novosibirsk, my former team, so wish us luck there as well. Alright guys, so for today's video, I really wasn't sure what I wanted to watch. Lots of matches out there and I just couldn't pick one. So I just started YouTubing, started Googling some volleyball and I really enjoyed doing the Japanese high school volleyball video that I did about a year ago. So I wanted to do another one of those, but from a different country. So today we're gonna be watching high school volleyball from Hong Kong, China, a match between, let me look, BBS and SKWGSS. I don't know anything about these teams, you guys. I don't know what this tournament is, what this match is, who's on this team, who's playing. I don't know anything about it, but we're gonna watch it. We're gonna watch their skill. I'm sure it's insane, just like the Japanese high school video that we watched. Analyze it, have fun with it, react to it. Let's do this. All right, I actually don't know the score. All I know is that it's the second set. The team that's serving is down one set to zero. Nice float. Oh. Got the ace, let's see this again. So a tough float serve coming. Libero tries to take it with his hands, covering a lot of court, just couldn't get around it. Yes, look at the celebration by that player. Hold on, what number is that guy? This guy running back. You love to see that, you guys. They're down one set to zero, they need some energy. That's the player that's gonna bring it. I love to see it. Float serve coming again. Goes after the libero. Tough serve, do you see how hard that dropped? Good up, run. Oh, that's the setter. Nice high ball, maybe a little bit tighter. Libero calls it off. He rips it and it went out. So two high balls there that maybe they could have went tighter. This is high school, you guys, I think. Tough to, to critique that, but maybe they want to set it off the net because maybe they're smaller players. It's hard to tell. Good float serve again. There we go, strong hands and used the block. So when that team was in system, they were able to set back, more in system, a quicker set, one blocker up, use the, use the block. I don't know if you guys can hear it. My sound is horrible on my computer, but there's a cheering section there, it's so cool. Another float serve. Nice pass. Woo! You guys, I don't know how tall these players are, but that guy does not look very tall. <laughs> and he just sprung up there and ripped that ball. So it started with a great pass by the libero. Shoulders were pretty forward, even though he came up. And then this player, was he just on a trampoline or what? Ripped that ball. Okay, setter serving here. This is the guy, oh yes. Great serve, getting this team out of system. Nice cover by DBS. Oh, bummer, that was such a nice dig. Look at this float serve. Just drives it low to the tape, gets him out of system. Great cover, high ball here. Better set, great dig. You can see those defenders were in the perfect spot. Unfortunately, it hit the net. Number nine serving here, is this the setter? They have some good what? Great cover, get up, get up again, woo! That was like a quick attack that I'm used to seeing in these Asian high school volleyball matches. Look how quick this was. So they get the touch there, sets it again, super quick, and they put it straight down. I don't know, that's not what my high school matches look like. That was a lot faster, you guys, trust me. All right, this server again, going with the float. They have good float serves, you guys. Ooh, is that is that the star player? Because that was like a rip cross court. So again, another great flow serve. They drive it so low to the tape. Out of system. Just set this player. Rips that cross court. Kind of just like floated up and was like, I think I'm going to hit there and did that. By the way, guys, this is from 2019, 2020. So maybe like a year or two. Number six serving or five, six. I don't know. Free ball coming. Let's see if they run a fast offense. Nice pass. Yep. <laughs> These middles, I know they're not the biggest middles out there. Oh, it is number five. They get up so early. Watch how fast this middle gets up. In high school. Boom. 
There's no way to block that unless you're committed on it. That's insane. Okay, number five. I think this is the star player, I don't know. Float serp. Dang, that's a good serve. <gasps> oh, he's not celebrating, he means business. That was right between the players. Tough ball to go, I don't know. I couldn't really tell by the angle, but that was a really nice float with pace and it was flat. Float again, going down the line. That might have been a double. Nice save. What happened? Out. I think they tried to save it, it just went out. Okay, out of the timeout, number five serving. I still don't know the score, they haven't shown it. Better pass here. Nice quick attack. Oh, he just missed it. I like that they ran that from off the net. He tried to push the tempo. They just missed it by a little bit. Pretty like daring set from a high school player. This number five is on a roll. Great serve. These floats are causing a lot of problems. And in general, I do think that there's gonna be more floats with these teams. They're on the smaller side. And if you can't rip a jump serve or put some weird spin on it, you gotta go with the float because that's at least gonna float to your opponents. Oh, and then he missed it. Number 12, back to serve. I don't know the score still. Another float. Great pass, casual. Woo! Let's see this technique again. You can see his shoulders were forward, his arms were out, pretty relaxed, nice. And then this hitter goes right through the block. That was just a one, two, three, side out. Great play. Number two, is that number two? Yep. Float serve, deep float serve. Catches the libero a little bit high. Ooh, a slide! Yes, you love to see a slide. Watch here. Right to the middle, he swings out, one foot. Crushes it, because if he went in front, there was no chance for him to set that ball, so he had to go behind, create some options for the setter, and put it away. Oh, it's my dream to hit a slide in a game. Whoa, this guy's far back there. Goes with the float. Nice pass, how is he even ready? Get up. He missed it out, just a little. I like how this server is so deep, and then he does this float. It's gonna cause some problems, because it's gonna float a lot. Oh, not on that one. Nice pass. Asking for the touch. No touch. Float again, deep float. Catches him high. There's the high, go! Oh, almost. So you can see, if a server's coming high at you guys, you either wanna move your feet back or get out of the way of it by opening your hips and creating angle on your side. That's my advice for that pass, but then he comes back, rips it high off the hands. The defender almost gets it. I love the effort by the defender. But we talk about high hands on this channel a lot, making sure you hit the fingers, and it's gonna go out or it's gonna come back at you in a recycle, and good things usually happen if you hit high hands. Float serve again. Nice pass, outside. Just missed it in the corner. Asking for a touch, I don't think there was a touch. Just missed it in the corner. Float coming again. Nice pass, you see those shoulders? Slide. <gasps> this time they blocked the slide. Let's watch the passing again. Let's pause on contact. Look at that. Everything I talk about on this channel, look at those shoulders, they're forward. His left shoulder is dropped because he's creating an angle on his right. That's how you get the ball up to the net. And then they run this slide. Dang, it got blocked right on the line. I love that play though. Okay, I know the score. DBS is up 21 to 13. I finally saw the scoreboard. Another float missed it long. So these guys are pretty aggressive with their floats. I mean, that's a couple of missed serves. They gotta go for it, I think. Gotta be strong with your hand there on floats and it's gonna drive out every once in a while. Okay, we have a serving sub in, down 14-21. Keeps it in. Make sure you keep your hand strong on, on serve receive if you're using your hand and then the hitter missed it out. So one thing with receiving with your hands, I don't do it very often, I'm not that comfortable with it. But if you are, you want to really want to keep your hand strong and then push up because that way the ball is going to go up and hopefully towards the net. This guy serving again, serving sub, got a real point, nice work. On the line, great pass. Tried to set number five, the pipe. Slide. Nice up, number five coming back with defense. Yes, defense! Come on. Free ball, let's see what they do. Number five, 
Number five is the guy. Sick up in that rally. Sick up by the libero for the other team. The, I can't remember the name. It was a long one, but that was a cool play. Here we go. Nice pass, perfect pass. Slide a little bit out of rhythm. He just got a set kill. Let's watch this again. So great pass here. The slide was a little bit out of rhythm here, but the block was up and the hitter recognized that. If you don't have a swing, maybe do a smart play like that guy did. Set it into the block, tip it, roll it, something, and usually good things will happen. So everyone float serves in this gym, which does not surprise me. Tough serves. Get up. Oh, oh, Ooh, ah. Free ball. Come on. Combination play. Was that a tip or was that off the block? Let's watch this again. So free ball here, middle takes it, middle nice pass. Combination play over the quick. Oh, he saw the open space in position four. Tried to roll it, hit the block, they couldn't play it. Nice point. 22 something. I don't know, I can't see it. Another float. Gosh, these are tough serves. Nice save by the setter. Setters, it's a skill to get the ball out of the net. You really want to be low, time it well, but the better you can get at that, the more balls you can save just like that setter did for this school. Kind of a mini comeback here. Float serve. Better pass, 10 foot line, nice. Ooh, something happened there. <gasps> no, that's devastating. So number five here, he's, he's smart, he's good. He doesn't have the set and just puts it into the corner. And there was a little bit miscommunication there, no! Okay, there's the score, 23 to 18. Two points away from victory for GBS. DBS, oh gosh, can't even say the right school name. Sneaks it through, what? How did he save that? Set the quick. Combination play again, a little bit out of rhythm. What, was that off the head? Nice save. Setters, we don't wanna take that free ball. Number five, sneaks it through. Okay, we're going back. So floater gets it in, libero takes it. Tough deep serve, nice fight. Somehow they get this up off the block. Free ball, combo play, tip, off the head! Don't take that ball, setters, if you don't have to. How did you say that off the head? And then number five, sneaks it through. 24-18, match point. Keeps it in, libero, perfect pass. Outside. <laughs> so that guy had tipped before, short. Maybe he recognized that everyone was charging forward and then tipped it deep. That is so smart, especially for a high school player. Are you kidding? Setter serving. I think this is my favorite player because he celebrates a lot. 1924. Gets him out of system. Oh. <gasps> and they hit the net. What's happening? I think they're challenging, let's see. Okay, they won the challenge, 2024. He didn't hit the net. Perfect pass, combination play to number five, of course, and he ends it. Let's watch that again. So you can see, perfect pass, 24-20. They're probably gonna do something funny here. They run the combination, the two ball inside the three. Number five puts it away for the set and the match 25-20 for DBS. All right guys, pretty cool to watch that high school match from Hong Kong. I am just obsessed with watching younger volleyball players and their skill set and how they improve over time. I think the first thing is just, they're so good at volleyball for high school. I know my high school, we were pretty good and I don't think we looked like that. We weren't running the quick like that. We weren't really running that many combination plays, but overall their skill set, their serving was just insane. So I'm just so impressed. And the second thing is, I just like to watch volleyball from all around the world. So if you guys have any recommendations for me to watch. Please write them in the comments and hopefully I will get to them eventually. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this short video. I hope you learned a little bit. I know I did. I learned that in Hong Kong they have really good high school boys volleyball, which I love to see. But anyway, get out, play some volleyball if you can, have some fun, and I'll see you all soon. Peace.